Russia is preparing for a presidential election with incumbent President Vladimir Putin is almost certain to win. Putin has already served as president for longer than any other Russian leader since Joseph Stalin, who ruled the then Soviet Union for nearly 29 years. Yunjin tells us more. Russia will be holding its 2024 presidential election from March 15th to the 17th with an all but certain outcome. That is incumbent President Vladimir Putin sweeping another six-year term. Putin has already continuously been either president or prime minister since 1999, serving as president from 2000 to 2008 and from 2012 to the present day. That's longer than any Russian leader since Joseph Stalin, who ruled the Soviet Union for nearly 29 years from the mid-1920s until his death in 1953. The 1993 Russian Constitution, based loosely on France's 1958 Constitution, originally specified that a president could only serve two terms of four years if served back to back. But amendments in 2008 extended the presidential term to six years, to which amendments were then made in 2020 that formally reset Putin's own presidential term tally to zero from 2024 potentially allowing him to remain in power until 2036. There are 102.3 million people in Russia with a right to vote in the election. Another 1.9 million people abroad have the right to vote. With a war in Ukraine grinding through its third year, voting will also take place in parts of Ukraine that are now being controlled by Russian forces, areas that Russia calls its new territories, which have been placed under Russian law. For this year's election, Putin has three opponents. Communist politician Nikolai Karitonov, Leonid Slutsky, leader of the nationalist Liberal Democratic Party, and Vladislav Davankov of the New People Party, who all publicly support Putin's policies. Candidates who stood against the war have been barred from running. Since Boris Yeltsin appointed Putin as acting president on the last day of 1999, Putin has won over 50 percent of the votes in four presidential elections. 53% in 2000, 71.3% in 2004, 63.6% in 2021, and 76.7% in 2018. According to a Russian non-governmental organization, even with the ongoing war, opinion polls at home show Putin's approval ratings at 85%, which is higher than before the war started in Ukraine. Kremlin officials say Putin's overwhelming support comes from people not wanting to be lectured by the West about democracy. Meanwhile, Yulia Navalnaya, the widow of Russian opposition leader Alexei Navalny, has called for a massive Election Day protest against Putin. Navalny, in one of his last public messages, had urged people to protest against Putin by forming large crowds and overwhelming polling stations at noon on March 17th. His widow is taking up her husband's call. The winner of this election will be inaugurated in May. Ian Jin, Arirang News.